Hi, my name is Steve Houston. If you've already been to Channel 04, you already know that. But if you haven't been here before, man, I'm fired up. Listen, on this channel, we try to flush out all that garbage out there. This is a great, phenomenal industry. Don't be discouraged. You should be in this industry if you have a gut for really wanting to help people and you want to change your life and have that work-life balance that we can have in this business because we get paid well. We get paid so well, it ought to be illegal. But on this channel, we talk about all things related to final expense and mortgage protection, and we expose the recruiting lies out there with these network marketing, multi-level marketing type companies that's all recruiting, no selling. It amazes me how many people say, well, hey, I don't, I don't sell insurance. I'm a recruiter. Hey, guess what? We're in an insurance selling business here. If everybody's just recruiting, how's anybody making any money? Well, we talk to you about that stuff. We talk to you about who has a great lead program and how to find out who has a, their own mailing program and who's buying some third party, you know, recycled, redated, driven over two or three times roadkill type leads that you don't want that they claim they're selling for the same price as everybody else. Well, they may be selling for the same price as everybody else, but the leads are garbage. This is my opinion on this channel. That's all it is, is my opinions. And when I present things, I try to present also third-party documentation to back up my rhetoric. If you've been here before, you know that, like I said. If you haven't been, make sure you smash that subscribe button. Hit the bell so you get instant notifications so I can spin right around here, do a quick video, and you're going to get the first-hand information or rant, whatever it is. But you want to be a subscriber. Hey, if you like the content, give me a thumbs up. Make a comment in the comment section, and I promise you I will respond to all comments. If I can help you try to figure out where to go, what I'm going to sign up with, hey, maybe we're a fit to work together. We won't know that until we have a conversation, but everybody's welcome here, and my job is to try to help you get through that decision because here's the bottom line. It depends on what you're looking for, so it's different for everybody. So maybe it's different for you than it is for me. We'll find that out very quickly. If you want those network marketing IMOs, all the rah-rah meetings and you know everybody's signing up somebody else, that's not who we are. Look, the great thing about what I do is I get so many of you calling me, texting me, emailing me, and having all these conversations that it helps me improve as an individual because I know a lot about what's going on in the industry. So this video is how to have instant success in mortgage section or final expense sales. That's the title of this video, how to have instant success in mortgage session or final expense sales. And here's the answer. It can be summed up in two words. It's not possible. No one is an instant success in this business or in any business. Where in the world did we get that expectation? Look, controlling our expectations is the number one, in my opinion, number one key to success in anything, but particularly in this business. It's more important than product knowledge. It's more important than can you convert a lead into a dial. It's more important can you get in the car and go see a family. Can you do an in-home presentation? It's more important than all that because if you set the wrong expectations, well, guess what? You're not going to be successful. And then you're going to get depressed and down and dumpy, and all these things are going to set in. It's amazing to me how people go out and run two or three appointments and don't make a sale and they're gone for 30 days or 45 days. And I reach out to them and they go, well, you know, I was a little upset or a little depressed, a little down because I, 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 you know, I went on three appointments. I didn't close anything. Seriously? You know, I've got years in this business and I'll still go on three appointments and not close any sales. Man, you got to come in with more than that to be successful here. You just do. You got to set the right expectations in your head. You may go on 8, 10, 12, 15 appointments until you start generating any kind of success. It sure beats the job to learn. You're learning new skills here, and this sure beats the job. As I tell my agents, you got to remember what you came here for. I have a rock on my desk right behind me, and it says... Remember why you started. Look, most people don't come here because they want to be great insurance salespersons. We came here because we're trying to solve something in our life. Maybe that's work-life balance. Maybe it's economical change in our life. We need to make more money. We need to support our family. Whatever the reason is, remember why you started. I mean, look, hopefully by now you've got a real passion for the client, right? If you're just a salesman and you never become an agent, you're going to struggle in this business. 
You got to own the product and you got to know, hey, listen, you know, tomorrow's not an option. You got to get that protection there in place today. A lot of this is, is passion driven for that client. Right? You gotta know that until they buy some protection, until their family is protected, they're at risk. And a lot of that, you, if you don't internalize that and you don't believe that, then you're just selling vacuum cleaners here. And I would submit to you that your chances of success are slim to none. You gotta know that what we do matters. And as far as getting back to having instant success in this industry or in anything, it's, let's get back to having instant success. Look, I, it amazes me is where this came from, okay? Let's take Henry Ford, for example. Henry Ford did not have instant success. Henry Ford failed and went broke five times before he succeeded. Henry Ford was known as a, you know, as a business magnet, a philanthropist, and a social entrepreneur. And he said this, failure is simply the opportunity to begin again, this time more intelligently. Let's take a look at Albert Einstein. He said, I've tried 99 times and have failed, but on the 100th time came success. Thomas Edison quotes, I have not failed. I've just found 10,000 ways that won't work. Edison made 1,000 unsuccessful attempts at inventing the light bulb. Look, folks, that takes passion. He was driven to create a light bulb. How many of you are willing to go out there and go on 1,000 appointments and write zero premium and make zero dollars and still stay in this business? I'm guessing it's zero. <laughs> Right? And that would be a shame because if you keep swinging the bat, you'll get a hit. And the more hits you get, the more successful you'll be. And you'll be successful and change your life financially for the rest of your life. Look, probably the greatest example of persistence is Abraham Lincoln. And because he didn't quit, Lincoln was a champion and he never gave up. There was many, many opportunities for him to give up. And some of you are thinking that success in this industry is more like a get rich quick path to success. And it's far from it. And if that's you, I will tell you that you're looking at this as a salesman and not as an agent. We all need to make money to support ourselves and our families. However, money can never be your single motivator for being here. You need to have more than I need to save the planet mentality. Those folks are passionate about their cause. We need to be passionate about our cause. Maybe this clip will remind you of a movie years ago called Back to School with Sam Kinison was really passionate about his cause. Good answer. Good answer. I like the way you think. I'm gonna be watching you. A good teacher. He really seems to care about what I have no idea. <laughs> All right, I love that old scene. Look, when you started to learn to walk and fell over and over again the first few months, did your mother tell your father, hey, the hell with this? Little Jimmy is simply not cut out to walk. I think he's going to crawl the rest of his life. Of course not. That would be silly. So why do you think the same way about this business? You need to get this business inside of you. Be driven to make sure that no one dies leaving their family unprotected. That's the secret to having success in this business. Everything else is semantics. You can learn how to book an appointment, converting a lead that you've received, get on the phone, turn in an appointment, select the products, get out to the home, do a presentation, write some apps, call your mentor or coach from the home. That's what our agents do. Every single one of them calls from home so we can help them answer their questions in the home, write the apps, get them from submission commission. If you can learn that stuff, you can be successful here and you can change your life financially and the quality of your life through being able to do that a couple of days a week to earn six figures. But you're, you're going to have to pay a price for it. Right? If it was that easy, everybody would be in insurance. Right? They're not. You know why? Because most people quit three feet from success, three feet from gold. And it's a shame. So here's my tip. There is no instant success. You got to come in here with that attitude of, I got to save the planet. I got to save Jim. I got to save Jack. I got to save Richard. I, gotta, I don't want them dying on my watch without their family protected. They've got to see me. You know, I got to get in the car and drive over and say, man, we got to talk. I've got to make sure that you're protected so that Jill and the kids aren't put at risk. It's a simple decision. Let's go through it. You got to have that attitude to be successful here because that makes you an agent and not a salesman. And if you 
you can do that, everything else will fall in place. But if you have the attitude, you gotta have this. Our team motto is, I will until do whatever it takes, no matter what. There's no deadline on that. There's no date. It doesn't say, no matter what, I will until do whatever it takes until December or three weeks from now or until next week or until my rent's due or my car payment's late. I'm only in this thing for a couple of months just to give it the old college try. You got to be better than that. You got to be passionate about what we do. What we do matters. We need you in this business, but you got to control this right here. I hope that helps. Give me a thumbs up. Make me a comment. Reach out to me. Give me a call. Shoot me an email and let's make sure you're set up to really explode out of the mud and prosper and get out there and make a living while making a difference. It ain't going to fall in your lap. You're going to have to work for it, but you can do it, but it'll last you a lifetime because if you can do those things, you can scale your income by just increasing your activity. Grateful that you're here and we'll see you on the next video. See you later. Bye-bye.